three quarters of the Earth's surface is covered by water. And whether you're in it, on it, or have it coming down on you in the form of wind-driven rain, sleet, or snow, Gore-Tex gear has you covered. Graf seems to be pretty much a hot spot for people getting after it in the mountains. It's scary in some ways, like the amount of unknown and the amount of exposure there is here. This place is really unique and special in the sense that there's just one lift and there's no trail map, there's no on-piste skiing of any kind. It's 100% on your own. Le Grave is definitely like the testing ground for any of your gear. If you're going out for a day of skiing, you don't know what you're going to be getting into, so you bring everything necessary. When you're out climbing around with crampons on, your ice axe is out, and you're clambering over rocks, you need something that's rugged and versatile. The durability of Gore-Tex is crucial in that environment. I'm feeling a little exposed. <laughs> a little bit of a crux right here. Yeah, dude. Everything's going to get tossed at you, uh, you know, in a day or especially over a course of a couple days in the Grave. Just about to jump across this uh, traverse. Me and Joe are roping up. It's go time. Having the trust in your gear is really important and knowing the fact that it's going to last day in and day out through the entire trip and through the entire season is pretty key. I always wear Gore-Tex when I'm, when I'm at home in Whistler, it's a super wet environment, so it's great for keeping me dry. When I'm here in Le Grave, it's a super breathable material. Um, when I'm climbing in high winds or, you know, whatever I'm doing throughout the day, I'm going to be dry and warm. As far as I'm concerned, it's the number one material for being out in the mountains. You know, last thing you want to be thinking about when you're setting up an anchor or like repelling into something or in an exposed zone is your equipment. You know, the whole crew is wearing Gore-Tex because it's going to stand up to whatever you can throw at it. So it's an obvious choice for everybody in the crew.